Every morning we get up and we start school and I go in the kitchen and just kind of freshen it up. Sometimes I leave dishes the night before and yes, I know that's bad, but I do. So I'm either unloading the dishes or loading some dishes in the dishwasher. Um, I'm in between doing school and then back in the kitchen. So it's back and forth. Um, here I am just wiping down the coffee pot, which I try to do once a week. The coffee just splatters and really creates just a kind of um, mess sometimes. So I just move it, wipe down the countertops, wipe down the coffee pot. I usually um, take out the trash, um, start a load of laundry for the girls, and just kind of get the house in the mode for picking it up, cleaning it, and setting the day. We just got done with school. It's 1221. Now we're done with school. I'm headed to pick up oh, I got a chapstick. Yeah. A different color for the girls' bedroom. This is my chapstick. You always should go with your first instinct when it goes when it comes to a project. So um, I promised the girls if they would get done with school. We would do um, a Taco Bell run. Can we get Sonic instead? And then um, run to Livingston and grab the paint. So that's what we're fixing to do. And then I'm gonna come home, try to start painting the girls' room. The girls are gonna start working on laundry, Who's folding it, I mean. And then um, I gotta figure out something for dinner. And then we have a grocery haul order at five o'clock. A huge one. We have nothing in our cupboards. No food, hardly. Um, I have freezer stuff, but no snacks. So I'll show you what we got for our grocery haul. Mom, did you get corn dogs? No, I never buy corn dogs. But like I'm saying, we have nothing in the house. Do we have anything in the cupboard? No. No snacks. So. We're in Livingston and we just picked up the paint and this is where I lived right down the road for years. So I lived out here for years as a teenager. So I'll take you guys by that house or the trailer that we lived in for years, like 15, 16 years. I'll show you guys in a minute. Titus has picked up page, like people in, um, accidents I think in this school right here this that field so this is sweet potatoes they're harvesting oh, sweet potatoes and yep lots of hard workers I see the potatoes the house Titus and I lived at for a whole year when we first got married oh, they painted it blue though yeah. it what it used to be gray it's a super cute little house that was our first Isn't house when we were married orchard? Yep, and I'd walk these roads right here. I would run, there's no one on these roads, so that's Memory why I'm doing lane. this. I'd run up and down this road, and it was two miles. <laughs> Isn't that funny? This is my friend's house. Her name is Faith. That's the trailer we used to live at right there, but it didn't look nothing like this. It's a <laughs> So, oh, you a little home. neater, I guess. Yeah. That one. It's weird. 
you should come. And I used to run up and down that road right there for two miles. I thought I would give you guys an update on the room. I've been just so busy. But anyways, I got the chandelier hung. I haven't cleaned it. And then I have like 20 more crystals I have to rehang because they fell off when it was being hung. But isn't it beautiful? The girls built the fort. So I'm going to leave that up for now. But what color did I go with you guys? I am making me a double espresso scuro. It doesn't make very much because it's obviously an espresso. And then I got this little tiny cup at the thrift center for 10 cents and I love it. I thought, when I seen it, I thought it was perfect for espressos. Right, I have one wall rolled. The other wall is almost rolled. Then I'm gonna roll them again and then start cutting in. <laughs> That's gonna be the tricky part. I'm in an old white t-shirt and you can see what it looks like. Um, I'm hoping I pick the right color with the different lighting on the wall, the two walls, it almost looks like a different paint color. So I'm like, oh no, I hope this turns out. Violet's all, you always can paint it again, mom. I was like, I know, because I have the other, I have Ella Rose paint too, a whole gallon. So if I don't like it, I'll just repaint it the blush rose gold color. All right, I'm gonna get back to it. I was kind of skeptical when I first started painting with this color. I was like, ah, I think I, I don't know if it's gonna work. But the more I started painting and the more the room started coming together, the color is just gonna be perfect for a farmhouse, kind of cottagey setting for the girls' room. And I might add, it covers very well. I come in here, Violet has made macaroni and cheese and corn dogs for her and Vivian. She made the macaroni, she's making tea. The only thing I told her is I have to lift this because it's gonna be like wobbly. And I don't want her to burn herself. But you cook the corn dogs in the microwave. And uh, then no, they were in the oven, but they were still cold, so I had to redo them. Oh redo. my word! You're the smartest little eight-year-old I've ever seen. Mom, take the macaroni and cheese. I'm sure it's good. I believe that's our order. Four hundred dollars worth of groceries. So funny. Just gonna wipe out the cupboard really quick while I try to organize some of the snacks. That way things are just organized properly so I don't have to do it tomorrow. So I plan on uh, doing the refrigerator tomorrow. <laughs> 